Hello. Uh, today I'm gonna prove to to everybody who is uh, interested to know who is the Yahweh, the God of the uh, millions of people in Christianity and in uh, uh, Judaism. Uh, I claim Yahweh is uh, the moon god Sin, and I will uh, provide the evidence and I will provide the links. Nothing I say is from my from my own i will uh, provide the links and you will read and you will uh, research yourself so you know that uh, what i'm saying is written in the links and i didn't write it so it is uh, proven with evidence so we start from uh, why did uh, didn't moses get the uh, Circumcised. We know that uh, Abraham uh, he got a uh, order to uh, covenant with uh, God Yahweh to become uh, circumcised, and he became he became circumcised uh, when he was 19, 99 years old. So Moses was not circumcised, and the evidence is here. We read from the Bible at the lodging place on the way the Lord Yahweh met him and sought to kill uh, to uh, to put him to death then zibura took a flint and cut off her son's foreskin and touched moses feet with and said surely you are the bridegroom of blood to me so he let let him alone it was then that she said a bridegroom groom of blood exodus 4 24 to 26 so here uh, moses he was not uh, he was not uh, circumcised uh, because uh, he married uh, zibora and zibora she was the daughter of the priest of midian and the priest of midian he was called jetro al yetro and yetro uh, is a priest uh, of Midian is mentioned in the Bible so Yahweh wanted to kill Moses because he was not circumcised so while he was uh, walking uh, he came to him Yahweh to Moses and tried to kill him but his wife Zipporah she knew wife why uh, what uh, Yahweh wanted she, she went to her son and uh, she took uh, with a stone flint she took uh, the foreskin of her son and touched moses feet here meant uh, that uh, she put the blood on moses uh, you know uh, the the, uh, the penis of moses so the penis of moses is full with blood so because otherwise yahweh who wanted to eat his penis because the foreskin is a sacrifice to Yahweh so he he wouldn't eat his penis so when the blood of his son or the Zipporah uh, the foreskin of uh, their son was put on uh, Moses uh, penis Yahweh uh, let let him alone he didn't kill him so he survived then we have this guy, moon god Sin in Har Karkun in Sinai Peninsula between Elat and Gaza and it's called uh, in Arabic Najab uh, uh, desert in uh, Hebrew Nag Nagaf the B becomes V Nagaf Nakab in Arabic so in 1994 they found a hermit cave and we know that uh, Moses went to the mountain in, uh, 40 days and remained there. So this cave uh, belongs to, the, to Moses. And it is, was called the Mount of God and the Mount of Saffron. Then we read, uh, yeah, God came from Sinai. This is from the Bible. And rose up from Seir into them he shined forth from Mount Paran Deuteronomy 32 2 
This is from the Bible. Then they found a black stone, a crescent, lying in a border in a place called Gal Ed. And Gal Ed is uh, mentioned uh, in the Bible. So uh, this is the Mount of Horeb or the Mount of Sinai. So in Exodus 18, 12, uh, we read that uh, Yetro, the priest of Midian, he respected God of Moses because he worshipped uh, uh, the God of Sin, the God of uh, the moon, the moon God. So, yeah, so Yet Yetro, he was a Kenite Arab, uh, uh, he was an Arabian man and he had another name like all Arabs and his other name was Re Ruel. And uh, these guys in the desert, they worshipped the moon, not the sun, because the sun was terribly hot. They worshipped the moon. So, uh, yeah. So this is in Exodus 3, 1. And we have, uh, we have the desert people of early Bronze Age dedicated to the mountain, to the moon, or rather to the moon Sin, the god of the moon Sin. And Ruesta Bastuni in 1997, she stressed possibility that the sin name Sinai would uh, drive it etymologically. It was called for the name Sin, that the Mount Sinai would be the mount, mountain of God Sin. So Sinai got the name from uh, the God the Sin. And I claim the God Sin is the God of the sinners. So if you kill, if you lie, if you uh, rape, if you uh, uh, do all these things, you belong to Yahweh, the God of the sinners. So all the sinners, they belong to Yahweh, his children. So if you are a good one, you don't belong to Yahweh, you need to, to, to spill blood, to belong to Yahweh, the God of the moon, as a sacrifice. He wants blood. So Moses went to Egypt, ordered by Yahweh in Exodus 2, 15, 2, 20, 3, 1, 4, 18, Act uh, 7, 29, 30. Because he was in the Mount Horeb in Sinai in 40 years. Yahweh said to him, go to Egypt and bring the, uh, the Hebrew the, 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 uh, to the Promised Land. Please... Uh, Enjoy your day, people, and know that all I'm saying is... Uh